Praise the Lord. I am Stephen George from St. Jude Church, Josola. Today, I will be speaking on missionary endeavors and the growth of the reunion movement of the Syro Malankara Catholic Church. When the Orthodox Church retracted from the church reunion activities, the members of Bethany religious communities went forward with the reunion activities with Archbishop Givergis Marivanius. The spiritual union between Martheophilos and Marivanius strengthened the movement and starting of a cloistered convent at Tirvalla to pray for reunion movement. Archbishop Givergis Marivanius gave importance to prayer in church unity carried out in the beginning stage of the reunion movement. This relying on prayer later on led to the formation and growth of the Syro Malankara Catholic Church. After the historical reunion movement, which was held on September 20, 1930, Rome sanctioned the Malankara Catholic hierarchy on June 11, 1932, centering on the Archdiocese of Trivandrum and the Diocese of Tiruvalla. Archbishop Givergismar Ivanius undertook the responsibility of the Archdiocese of Trivandrum and Martheophilos as the Bishop of Tiruvalla. Lots of priests and laity from the Jacobite, Orthodox and Marthoma churches reunited with the Catholic Church. Lots of priests and sisters from the Syro Malabar and Latin dioceses came forward for the pastoral services and for the success of the reunion movement. In the beginning of the reunion movement itself, Archbishop Givergis Mar Ivanius gave leadership to the missionary activities in the regions of Southern Travancore. As a result, the Archdiocese of Trivandrum was divided and the Diocese of Marthandam was established in 1996. Reverend Lawrence Mar Ephraim became its first bishop. Joseph Massiverius, who was the Bishop of Nerulam of the then Orthodox Church and who vigorously fought against the reunion movement reunited with the Catholic Church, making his profession of faith before Mar Ivanius in 1937 and undertook the reign of the Diocese of Tiruvalla in 1939. Thomas Mardirias Koros, the head of, of, of Kananaya Jacobite Church, reunited with the Catholic Church in 1939. Archbishop Givergis Mar Ivanius passed away on July 15, 1953. His mortal remains are entombed at St. Mary Cathedral, Trivandrum. His Grace Metropolitan Benedict Mar Gregorius succeeded and was enthroned on January 27, 1955. Under his spiritual guidance, the Malankara Catholic Church grew fast. In 1977, the head of independent Toriur Church, Paulus Marpiloxenos, reunited and became a member of the Catholic Church. Rome, having accepted the need of a diocese for the migrants of the Malankara Catholics to Malabar, divided the Diocese of Tiruvalla and started the Diocese of Bathiri in 1978. Most Reverend Cyril Marbasilius became the first Bishop of Bathiri. In 1983, a major seminary of the Malankara Catholic Church was started at Pattam. Later, it was transferred to Nil Nallamchira. In 2003, the Diocese of Tiruvalla was bifurcated and the Diocese of Moorpatabula was established and Most Reverend Thomas Mar Kurlos was made the first Bishop of Moorpatabula. In 2005, Syro Malankara Catholic Church was raised to the major archiepiscopal having the synodal arrangement and Archbishop Cyril Mar Basilius, Archbishop of Trivandrum, was raised as the head and father of the Malankara Catholic Church and major Archbishop. When more and more Cyril Basilius expired, Isaac Mark Lemis became the major Archbishop Catholicos. Later, he was raised as the first cardinal of the Syro Malankara Catholic Church. In 2007, the Archdiocese of Trivandrum was divided and the Diocese of Mavelikara came into existence. And Most Reverend Joshua Mar Ignatius became the first bishop 
of Mahavelikara. For the service of the people of God in India outside the official jurisdictional boundaries of the Malankara Catholic Church, Reverend Father Chako Ered, OIC, was ordained bishop on February 16, 2007, under the name Jacob Marbar Navas. He worked with Delhi as his headquarters. In 2010, Archdiocese of Trivandrum was further divided, and the Diocese of Patanam Theta was established with Most Reverend Yuanon Markrisostam as its first bishop. In 2010, the Diocese of Bateri was divided and the Diocese of Puttur was established for the Kannada speaking people of the Church of Karnataka and Givargis Madhivanasiyos undertook the responsibility of the diocese as its first bishop. In 2010, a new exarchate was begun for the Malankara Catholic based in America. Later, on 4th January 2016, the exarchate was promoted as the Diocese of St. Mary, Queen of Peace of the United States of America and Canada with His Grace Thomas Mar Eusebius as its first bishop. In 2015, the Church received the canonical and juridical authority to preach the gospel and to establish parishes all over India. Delhi Gudugao Diocese was established on 1st May 2015 and Moose Reverend Jacob Marbar Navas was appointed as the first bishop. Pune Kadki Exarchate was established on 30th May 2015 with Moose Reverend Thomas Mar Athanasius as the first bishop. Later, it was elevated as the Syro Malankara Catholic Eparchy of St. Ephraim of Kadki by Pope Francis on 23 November 2019. The Eparchy of Parashala is the 11th Eparchy formed by bifurcating the major Archdiocese of Trivandrum. The Eparchy of Parashala was erected on 5th August 2017. On the same day, His Excellency Most Reverend Thomas Mario Sebius was appointed as the first bishop of Parashala. His Grace Mar Ivanius, the leader of the reunion movement, was raised to the rank of Servant of God in 2007 by Catholic Church. After the reunion movement, the missionaries increased. Their objective is to help the society, expand the diocese and expand the Syro Malankara Catholic Church to other regions and spread the message of the Lord. Over the years, the number of members working in the missionaries have also increased. The hungry, sick and orphans have benefited a lot due to the services of these missionaries. Due to the dedication of Marivanius and missionary of the Catholic Church is growing. Due to their effort, today the Malankara Catholic Church stands strong. Marivanius is the reason why Syro Malankara Catholic Church has successfully completed 91 years of reunion. I am happy to say that today there are about 14 bishops with one cardinal and one archbishop, 800 priests, 2000 religious sisters, about 5 lakhs of faithful and 1000 parishes and many schools, many higher educational institutions, hospitals and nursing homes and social centers around the globe. The geographical area of our Gurgaon Diocese is consisting of 23 states of India. The Syro Malankara Catholic Church had only two dioceses just after the reunion movement. But over the years, due to the constant effort of the members of the Malankara Catholic Church and due to the prayers of Archbishop Givargi Smar Ivanius and other prelates, today we have 12 dioceses. The Syro Malankara Catholic Church has established five dioceses outside Kerala, which is a huge achievement. Even today, the priest, sister, and faithful of the Malankara Catholic Church are carrying out missionary in different parts of India and world. I am proud to be a part of the Catholic Church. 
If we continue to work hard, we can help this church grow further. Let us thank Archbishop Givargi Smar Evanius for his dedication and God for giving us the strength and grace of Holy Spirit. Thank you.